Welcome back watch fans. Today I've got uh, a watch that I'm going to be servicing. Uh, it's a uh, an Anker and I believe it probably comes from the late 70s, uh, perhaps the uh, the early 1980s. Um, so I figured I'd go ahead and throw in some other videos. Kali gave this to me uh, to, to work on for him and I figured I'd do a video uh, it's an Anker. They come from East Germany. I'll try and do a video and I will put that at the end. Uh, but, uh, I, I figured what I'll do is I'll probably do a service and, uh, I won't be talking during most of it. If I do, I'll throw in some comments, but, uh, I'll do a lot of captions at the bottom. I have another, uh, Anker. I think this one's a little bit nicer. Um, the one on the right here, but, uh, I don't remember where I got it from. Uh, I think it came with a lot. I've, I've worked on it a little bit. It's working. Um, but very nice watch. This one, uh, usual, usual deal. It uh, runs and stops. So my guess needs a basic service. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take it apart. Not even going to unwind the main spring. I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to uh, remove any of the springs. I'm literally just going to disassemble put in the ultrasonic cleaner, oil it, and reassemble, and we'll see how it goes. So, all right, let's get started. This is definitely um, a more simple technology. Uh, this reminds me probably of the inexpensive, what is it? The, uh, the inexpensive Timexes that they used to have, no dual movements, where it worked off of pivots. It's pretty much the exact same thing here. Um, and actually that makes it even really easy for me because to be quite honest with you, uh, these movements, you don't even have to disassemble there's literally no point. Uh, what I have to do uh, that, so like the Timex watches, you're actually just supposed to completely disassemble them. And, uh, I'm sorry, you're, you're supposed to keep them assembled because there's no jewels, there's nothing to even worry about and you literally put the entire thing into an ultrasonic cleaner or into a bath of alcohol. So that's actually what I'm gonna do. Um, there's literally no jewels in here. So, but what I am going to do is I am going to take uh, the face and the hands off, obviously, because those will get ruined.
All right, there you have it. That one was kind of a pinch, but yeah, that is a East German Anker with a non-rebuildable movement. <laughs> but uh, it needed a good cleaning and it seems to be ticking along just fine, keeping good time. So that's that. Hope you enjoyed this. If you liked the video, please like. Uh, also, please subscribe. It makes this worthwhile. Thank you very much.